Okay, so what we're looking at here is the shark's brain, so the nervous system. And if we start pretty much at the top, if we look way up here, we kind of see this kind of grayish membrane that's up here. And this would actually be the olfactory nerve. It actually kind of has a banded pattern, which then is connected to this little swelling here, which is the olfactory bulb. And this skinny little line here that you see on both sides coming from both directions, oops, uh, right there is the olfactory tract. So olfactory nerve, olfactory bulb, olfactory tract all have the function of sense of smell. Then we have these two swellings here, which are the most anterior big portion in the middle of the brain. And this would be the cerebral hemispheres, which are for higher thinking. Next to the eyes, we actually have these two lobes right here, which are kind of, you can see I can pull this one back and expose them a little more. These two lobes are the optic lobes and their function is for sense of sight. Then you have this big circular structure here that has like a cross pattern in it. This is the cerebellum and the cerebellum's function is for balance and muscle coordination. Going deeper into the brain, we see there's something right here. It has a divot in the middle and then it has two bands that kind of narrow into a V shape. This whole region right here is the medulla oblongata and its functions are involuntary life functions such as heart rate and breathing. And then if we go down even further when it narrows into one single pathway, then this would actually be the dorsal nerve cord whose function is to transmit messages between the body and the brain.